Hello everyone, I welcome you all to this channel. I have a word for you, a very powerful word for you. And before we get into the word, I thank you all uh, for the good work and uh, for the encouragement that you give to others and for the prayer requests. If you have a prayer request, you can send in your prayer request and uh, I'll pray for you. And uh, go ahead to like and share this video to somebody else because you never know who will be touched by this message. Do not just assume that people are going, that everything is, is well for somebody else because the person that you think that everything is well could actually be going through hell, could even be going through much worse than what you are going through. Do not be fooled by their smiles. Do not be fooled by the good text messages they send you. Because behind that text message, behind that smile, could lie somebody, could be somebody who's crying out for help. Sometimes people are going through a lot of things that they are afraid to speak it out. They are afraid to tell somebody. So open up to somebody, tell somebody, Testify of the good works of God. Now, if you're new to this channel, I kindly request you to subscribe and go ahead and press the notification bell so that you may receive uh, videos, the first video that I upload. Now, to go into the word that I have for you, the word is do not look back. Because there are times when God will bring you out of a situation, out of a mess, out of a predicament, and he wants you not to look back. Because if you look back, you will be drawn back to the same situation. You will be reminded of the same old thing that intimidated you, that tormented you, that brought you down to your knees. The word is, do not look back. It is time to move on. It is time to put your head forward. Look at the things that are in front of you, not backwards. Have you asked yourself, why is it that God designed your legs to face frontwards? Why did he design your eyes to face in front? Your nose is in front. It was because you are a person that is designed to move forward, to look forward, not behind. Your eyes are not behind, but they are forward. Your mouth is in front. You are supposed to not look back. Very important. Let me give you the consequences. Let me tell you the consequences if somebody looks back. And we can see this clearly in the scriptures. Now, there was a time when the angels of the Lord came to Lot and they told Lot and his family to get out of the land, to get out of Sodom and Gomorrah because that land was going to be destroyed. Listen very careful. I know many of you know this story, but when Lot was told to move out of the land, he was given an instruction. The instruction was not to look back. So, Lord left the land, and as he was out of the land, the wife made a mistake. Maybe it was because of the sound that she had, and she was compelled to look back. And as she looked back, she turned into a pillar of salt. She disobeyed God's word. And that was her story. It was that she was gone. She was not redeemed because she looked back. So do not look back. If it is a sin that you have been doing, 
if it is something that God has told you to live, whether it's an addiction, don't go back to the same old thing. Don't go back to the same old thing that tormented you. Don't go back to the same area that you were told to live. To the same old mentality, to the same old way of thinking, to the same way of doing things. It could be even the friends. And go say, leave that person. But you want to go back to that same old person in that same old group. Do not look back because it is for your good if you move forward. It is for your good. Now, I thank you everyone that uh, you have watched till the end of uh, this video and uh, you have been blessed by the words that I've spoken and the words that you have heard. And I am also blessed sometimes by the comments that you, you write down. And uh, it encourages me to move forward. It encourages me to, to do the things that I'm supposed to do. Um, I thank you all. And uh, if you're going through a lot of, uh, uh, things that you cannot explain, things that uh, you cannot comprehend, keep on praying. Tell somebody to pray for you. Because there is power in prayer. There is power in his name. And if you call upon his name, you will surely be saved. The message, remember, is do not look back. Be blessed.